Prime time news this evening. Accused in murder of four from a Portland Eastern MP, Dr. Linville Bloomfield skips bail. Hotelier speaks on suspect in social media influencers' murder, staying at his property. And 10 shot as criminals go on a rampage in Clarendon. Good evening and welcome to Primetime News, on air and online at onespotmedia.com. I'm Herman Green. And I'm Janela Precious with a preview of what's the coming business news. Here's Javon Keys. Well, Janela, all red arrows for gas prices this week. That means they're all going up. I'll tell you by how much later on. All right, thanks. And Je Jeremy is also here. You'll tell us what's coming up in sports. Jeremy? Uh, uh, thank you, Herman. Well, Wayne Shaw, he's been the yeah, president of the most powerful football, Confed, Kasafa. Well, he's about to step down with just about eight months remaining in his tenure. We'll tell you more a bit later on. There's also sports commentary, E-Prime and weather in this newscast. But before the break, the feedback question. This evening we're asking, are you satisfied with Cabinet's decision not to sanction the health minister over his handling of the bacterial outbreak at the Victoria Jubilee Hospital? You can share comments online, facebook.com slash television Jamaica and tweet us at television jam one. Please stay tuned. Primetime News returns after this break. <laughs> 